Well, welcome to my Let's Play of Soul Crystals. Oh yeah, I got hit enter. This game doesn't use standard controls. And right off the bat, I don't know why there's an HP and MP meter in the corner. Um, the planet is Earth, and the year is 1705, and a place called Oaktown. So our story starts in this green world of life. However, evil is coming to the world. Coming spelt wrong. The sentences are... There's too many um, periods and stuff in this. <sighs> a dark force seals the souls of people into crystals that give birth to powerful beasts. It wasn't until the princess's soul was so encased that the queen begin to take notice. It should be began. She calls upon a warrior named Hughes to save her daughter and the other souls that have been encased. Hughes agrees, not for the queen or the princess, but because of his friends, Fafina and Mahala, who were also captured by the spirit. With gameplay inspired by The Legend of Zelda and music lifted from East, the Ark of Napishtim, Hughes will need all of his wits, skills, and determination to free the souls of those captured by the unknown dark power. And with face sets lifted from Hero Saga, Leviathan Tactics. I actually have a Let's Play for that game on my channel. It's not completely finished yet, but I should be getting an update today. Hughes, get out of bed. The king and queen wants to see you right away. It's about the princess and your friends. Okay, woman, tell the king and queen that I will be there right away. Way spelled wrong. There's no A at the end there. And that's not actually a, f a male, uh, is that actually a female f face set? Magistos is a male character in the game he comes from. So I guess you could argue this is gay marriage we're seeing here. Um, Hughes, is that you? I see you made it here safe. However, I have some bad news to tell you. My dater, should we, the princess and you friends' souls have been put into soul crystals, and I'm sure that's lifted from some other game that's I don't really can't name right now, to create more powerful beast by the boss beast of the land. If this happens, no one will be able to stop their dark power. You and your brother are the last hope of save this land. To save this land. However, I hope you can save my child and your friends in time. So what do you say what do you say can yes however I must save my friends first and after all this is done I will need gold and silver if you don't mind sure young man for you are a skilled fighter okay little brother let's go save the day and after I can go get a cold beer and some ribs <sighs> you're gonna do it in a day huh just head down the steeps that should be steps there's no t there's not two e's in that word the monster should be down there, and maybe your friends here have some apples. Good luck, you two. Ah, so the battle begins. Okay. I don't think there's anything of interest up here, but... <laughs> what is it? Not now.
Okay, so he can't get hurt by him. Well, since we don't seem to be getting hit by the enemy, I think I'm just going to pause the recording and go walk the dog and see how many levels I can rack up while I'm away. I won't make any money, obviously, or pick up any items, because they disappear after a while, but I guess I can pick up a bunch of levels, assuming the enemy is just infinitely spawning. Yep. See you in a bit, I guess. Or for me, it won't be. It'll probably be more like an hour and a half. Well, it doesn't look like I got too many levels, to be honest. Um, at least not on Hughes, because apparently the experience you get is um tied to who does the killing blow, so... Well, Balram got a whole bunch of levels. My main character got barely anything. Uh, what levels I did get was based on what I was doing, doing some grinding on my own here. Um, I'll need that money. Oh, this is pointless. Boss flame for our brothers. Hey Hughes, look there. Up ahead, there are the soul crystals. Yes, I see the this. However, we need to get past them first. The flame brothers. However, they are no match for us. Let's take them down. Okay, let's go back. It looks like the souls have left the crystals. Our friend should be outside waiting for us. What was that? Ah! No! Barum! No, big brother. Why did you have to die? You just wanted to live your life in peace without all the fighting. I pray your soul is in a better place. Hughes, I'm really sorry about your brother and stuff. I know that you loved him, just like my sister and me. Well, thanks for saving my soul. I am sorry as well, young Hughes. As you can see, I am alive. However, my flesh... It's flesh, with an E. It's cursed by magic, not cruised. So I can never be flesh and blood, or can I? Thanks, you two, and I am sure there's a way you can become flesh and blood. Again, I've skipped over the rest of it. Whatever. Stop. Whoever killed my brother while <sighs> removing your flesh and blood curse. <clears throat> now we have two characters that can move without our guidance. Um... No, that's where I'm going to go to the weapon shop, probably. No, you can put your items in the hotkeys at the bottom of the screen. Apples go on items by pressing 7 key. Oh. It's not 1, 2, 3, it's 7 through 8, 9. Uh 
Good day, how can I help you? I have some good weapons for sale. I hear someone's taking the princess and put her in a cave or something, in some town with mountains and stuff. If you want to become strong, start off killing the low level monsters for a while. <sighs> Nothing, um. Hi, welcome to Lightning Town. This is a rich, bountiful place, and the king and queen are nice, too. Why is it getting dark all of a sudden?
Hi, who are you? Hold on, I know who you are. The Royal Templar of the Castle Town. Nice to meet you, sir. It's good to see your other hero like me. No, you are a good man. Yus, good luck out there, friend. Oh, hi, dear. How are you today? Look out for the bad old monsters outside of town. Be safe. Thank the Lord for the town guards. They'll put them in their place. Welcome to my inn. How can I help you? The rest will be 30 zaps. Problem is, whenever you go to a place like this, it auto-collects it. Yeah, it's the A button to attack, duh.
Why can I walk on this water? Whatever. What the? Oh, you gotta stock her up on arrows? 
Ah, oh, shit. That's annoying. Yeah, yeah, whatever. I just found out I gotta go buy a bunch of arrows. Ten? Are you kidding me? What's the maze? We're gonna have to buy constantly? They should be more like two. I think I'll call it quits here for now. We can deal with the cave next time. You need to grind out some levels, I guess, and get some more money saved. I have to upgrade all my equipment, and then hope this game doesn't have some sort of secret sword feature that resets them all. Ugh, until next time, then. See ya.